Cluestone Cupcakes. Looking good. Simic Slaw. What's in that? Lots of things. Hmm. Two pitchers of Gruelade. Nice. Hidden Strings Cheese. Really? The Boros Burger Battalion. In what way is that Boros? Red meat, white buns. Well, I brought chips. Graham, come on. You know how much I love the Pro Tour. It's like the Stanley's Madness Bowl of Magic. And we finally got the four of us together to watch a replay, and it's like you're not even trying. Dude, I am psyched. Believe me, it's block constructed, they're gonna draft, and Team Channel Fireball is gonna clean house. Heck yes they are. That's the spirit. Hey, losers. Are you ready to fall to the superior power of Team Star City Games? Not likely, my friend. Ooh, what food did you bring? What's the theme? Uh, these are, uh, Louis Scott vegetables. Thank you. At least you're trying. You, however, do not get any Simic Slaw until you come up with a better name for your chips. What's in that? Lots of things. Yeah, I'm, I'm okay without. All right, so I put Alpha Authority and Madcap skills on this Centaur Courser. Must be blocked by more than one creature. Cannot be blocked by more than one creature. Yep. 20 go to 10. Who is the master? I am the master. Woo woo, technicality police. I believe you're actually the mistress. No, because Modern Mistress sounds like a clothing store that sells lots of leather. I, uh, can I? We have to draft with that. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're gonna draft this so hard. With who? With the guys. They're watching the Pro Tour. Well, when they're done. Oh, I can feel the value. Why don't we just go join them? So smooth. Because I, stop that, don't want to get dragged into their stupid team rivalry. Dad wife. Five Pro Tour top eights, 10 GP top eights, 336 lifetime pro points. LSV's got this on lock. Dude, Martel is coming hot off a Pro Tour win. He's hungry, he's gonna crush LSV. Yes, let's pit these real life friends against each other in an imaginary feud. Hurrah! It's like you're not even in the Pro Tour spirit, Paul. What are you talking about? I'm totally in the Pro Tour spirit as a nice guy. Like... The nicest man in magic? You next leveled me, Paul. GG. Oh, shit, shit, shit. it's about to start. Oh, okay. Really? What? Yeah? Where's yours? Remember we worked one out. LSV, Lord Sultan of Value? Yeah, I must have left it uh, at the grocery store when I was buying chips. Hey, keep being salty, young man, and you ain't gonna get any Simic slaw. Nobody wants the slaw with lots of things, James. I do, however, want to crack into one of these clue stones. Wait, what? I'm gonna crack this clue stone? Hey guys, I just had a hilarious idea. What if you both looked over there for like 30 seconds? No! Well, I mean, we could open one booster, right? Like 15 cards? How do you feel about 15 stitches? Whoa! Whoa. I'm sorry, I haven't had coffee today. That's why you encoded trait doctoring onto a defender. I'm playing trait doctoring? Who am I? What I'm saying is, we could, could, open one booster. Just, just one booster. Draft. Just one! And we could say that it's my booster, so it'd be a disadvantage for me. And we could look at it. Draft. And try to figure out what our first pick would be. Playing against a decaffeinated cam is kind of like battling a high-functioning lemur, so tempting. No. Kathleen, you stay strong. Jer, you stop giving her ideas. Cam, you go get coffee. Jer and Kathleen, Cam trusts that nothing will happen to this pristine box of delight until he gets back. And make Cam go get coffee. Cam, go get coffee. Cam, get coffee. So Kathleen. No. I was thinking. Nope. That if you told Cam I did it while you were out of the room, you would have plausible deniability. Looks like the judge is just gonna ask him to shuffle that back into his deck. Boy, come, on! come on, judge! It's a fair call, judge. That should be a game loss at least. Dude, a card fell out of his hand. Clearly, the judge doesn't know the rules. Do you? 
Well, no, there are a lot of them. Exactly. Paul, if we didn't tell the judges and players how to judge and play, what would we be? Uh, spectators? Yeah, but we have opinions, and our opinions differ from theirs. And that's what the game is about! Yeah, like, look at this opening hand. I'd mulligan that. What? Clearly that's a snap keep. I think that's debatable. I'd concede. Yeah, see, Paul, everyone- you'd concede? Dude, if that was my opening hand, I'd concede the match, give away all my cards, move to the country, and become a deranged hermit. Really? On the draw? Oh no, on the draw, I would keep it for sure. Ah. Change target cam's type to human. What did you do?! Kathleen said I could open a pack. Jer! Draft? I'm, I mean, Kathleen. It's done, okay? Come here and tell us what you'd pick. Well, that sort of light and shadow seems pretty optimal. Eh, I've seen better swords. Besides Cam, there's fairies! Fairies! You. You would take fairies. Yeah? Besides the fact that it's clearly not the pick over the sword of light and shadow, you don't strike me as the kind of person who's into fairies. Look, Cam, these are not children's fairies. These are tiny hellspawn, and they will sneak into your bedroom at night and sew your eyes shut. These are my fairies. Also, they counter spells. Hmm, right. Gross. Well, sign me up. Although, you could make a pretty compelling argument for the kitchen things, or, or the narcomoeba, or... Oh, this pack is disgusting. It makes me so happy. Eh, those are boring. Fairy trouble all day long! Right, Jer? Well, the pick is obviously grape shot. Really? Out of all of this? And a sword? Why? Then you can build the storm deck! But that relies on getting a bunch more stuff, like reach through mess, for example. Yes, which is my second pick. Jer! We said we'd only open one pack! But, check this out. In pack three, someone passed me empty the warrants. Oh, you've opened three packs? Well, no, we've already established you can't draft with three people. No. The next five packs were also pretty good. I got a desperate ritual, a manamorphose. Someone even passed me this second grape shot. What? Who passed it to you? Someone to my right who obviously didn't know how to draft Storm. Ah! Oh! oh! Sick top deck. That was pretty fantastic. And CFB is doing great. I think we're going to have a player in the top eight. I can't wait for the next Pro Tour. Wait. Dude, that was just day one. Let's get going with day two replays. Yep. Do we have to get all this weird food? Couldn't we just order pizza or wings or something like normal people? Paul, that's the whole point. Just wait until the Pro Tour in October. I have this awesome recipe for Theros Euros with legendary tzatziki. Wait, do the new legendary rules mean I need more garlic? I'm going to the store and I'm going to be bringing back more chips. What? There's still plenty of Simic Slaw left. No, James, you said there were things in it. You eat some. Ugh, no, I know what those things were. It would have been beautiful. It would have been like drafting a cube. They would have sent a poet. I couldn't help myself. Like a demonic tutor, the cards called to me. Wait, Cam, what did you say? They would have sent a poet? No, before that. Boy, I hope I don't get into a fist fight with my friends today. You said that? I say that every day. No, before the poet thing. It would have been like drafting a cube? <gasps> That's it! Get me some sleeves! I'm gonna crack the rest of these packs. <gasps> no, it's fine, Cam. Watch. I'll sleeve them up. What? Add the one storm card. They were too chicken to reprint. More value. Boom. Now we have a cube that we can draft whenever we want. You're a genius. Like a human astronaut. Sweet, let's draft now. Okay, but no storm. Aww. Hello, you're live on speakerphone. Guys, get down here and draft. Just started day two, this is getting tense. <sighs> None of your players make it to top eight. Oh! What? Stormcrow? I thought you said this cube didn't have power in it. Well, I concede. 